Have you heard of gene therapy? It is a method to deliver genetic payloads or therapeutic modifications to specific locations in your DNA and fix the problems. However, your circulatory system is like a chaotic highway. How are the delivery vehicles going to find their ways and drop the therapeutic package at the right destinations in your body? Hi, I'm Xin Hong Chen. I'm a graduate student in Guadinaru lab at Caltech. I'm trying to tackle these delivery problems by engineering specialized virus for specific locations in your body. Let's take a step back. The normal functions of your systems relies on precise regulations and interactions among cells, such as the synchronized neuron firing in my brain at these moments when I'm speaking to you. When these precise regulations break down, we need to have a ways to assess them and fix them. For the fixing parts, we now have developed great tools such as CRISPR, which you could use as a mouse to point to the specific locations of your DNA, altering the informations there and bring them back to normal. But how are you going to deliver these wonderful tools to the specific destinations in your body? It is actually very challenging. If you think of the complicated vascular network and the numbers of components floating in there, it is like a chaotic highway. Luckily, nature gives us virus. There's a harmless virus named adeno-associated virus. Scientists have taken this virus from nature and transformed them into great delivery vehicles in clinical settings. However, there are two main challenges still persist. First, some of these delivery vehicles, they get off the highways at random stops. For example, if you are going to send a team to fix the problems only in the brain, but they end up working the liver, which could lead to potential side effects. So we want to send them to a specific locations, but don't want them to go to elsewhere. Second, there are some prohibited zones in the body which prevent these vehicles to go in. So when this virus don't have the permit to go in this zone, we don't have the capacity to fix the problems there. To overcome all these difficulties, we try to engineer the outer surface of the vehicles. When we engineer them, we send them out and pick the ones that get to the right destinations. If we are not satisfied with the specificity or the efficiency of the delivery service, we will just keep engineering them and repeat the process. With several rounds of engineering and selections, our end goal is, if you told us you have a specific problem in a specific part of your body, we can pick a bus or a truck that is designed for the specific locations for your problems and send the DNA swap team to fix the problems, but not causing problems elsewhere.